flow. I done done it all. Feel like shot it low. Left me to the pain, but shit is not a joke. Say she got a pop, imaginary smoke. Bitch, she set it up, then put it on the floor. Uh oh, the game in trouble. Started out small, and they paying me double. Yeah, you can drip chip, baby, like mustard. Yeah. This bathroom is huge. Oh my god. This tub? What? Oh my gosh. This room is only me in it. Oh my goodness. Oh, period. Yes. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. It's dark right now, you guys, but I actually have a pool. I don't know if you can see, but yeah. Good morning y'all. I'm actually starving. We did not eat dinner last night because I was too tired And then I've been up since like four o'clock in the morning because jet lag and anxiety yes. It's 7 54. I'm gonna go to breakfast right now I'm just like what am I gonna wear to breakfast, but I think I'm just gonna throw on something chill But I'm really hungry so I'm just gonna throw something on figure out where breakfast is and walk on over to it and Start my first day. Well, I guess technically day two, but first full day here in Phuket I'm staying at the Mandarava Resort and Spa on Karan Beach and so far I like it We'll do you know full reviews later, but so far it's, it's cute. My room is literally huge and you see the pool. So let me just throw something on. I'm hungry. My friend is waiting for me at breakfast. Her room is like a little around the corner from mine. I also don't know if like I have to pay for breakfast and like how that works. So we'll find out. But I, I just want to throw something like quick and easy on. And then like come back and put what I'm ready for the day. All right, I'm just going to breakfast. If y'all see this later and you see me wearing it. Yes, I'm an outfit repeater. I'm pretty sure this was from the store that everyone hates. I'll just put it that way. Um... But yeah, I'm just gonna go to breakfast now. Literally straight from my morning plunge. If I go to jail, hey, money for the bill, hey, money on the scale, hey, uh, give me a minute, huh? Yeah, I need a minute, hey, I'm a minute, minute, huh? I'm needing a minute, hey, I'm going to take, hey, Cardi B and Pip. Alright, guys, I'm just about to take a charcoal pill because I don't want like, food poisoning. Yeah, a lot of people come to Southeast Asia and they get like. You know, you've heard of Bali belly or just like sick in general. There's a lot of street food and there's new bacteria that us people from the West aren't always used to. So I started taking these probiotics like a week or two ago. And then I'm now that I'm in Phuket, I'm going to start taking one of these a day, a charcoal pill. Yeah, I don't know if we're going to get street food today, but just in case, your girl will be prepared. And I actually suck at swallowing pills, you guys. Like I did not know how to swallow a pill until I think I was in like... Eighth or ninth grade, like maybe ninth grade. It was like when I got braces. I think I got braces in ninth grade because I had to because the pain was so bad. But a little probiotic. About to get lunch and then we're gonna go to the tigers. I'm so excited. Oh god. Oh, it's all over my finger. My finger got all black. 
bottoms up. Uh, we're gonna have to find a better way. What is this? We're gonna have to find a better way to do this charcoal situation. But yeah, that was my first time taking them. It wasn't bad, it wasn't bad. My room is actually crazy, it looks terrible. So I'm not gonna do a room tour yet, but when I get back, hopefully housekeeping will have came and then I'll show you. I feel like I already showed you all like the star, like the view, the pool view. But like, I wanna give you all the full thing, but I literally, one, I overpacked, so there's just stuff everywhere. Two, I just need them to like redo the room. And also it was dark when I came in here. I like, I tried to do a room tour, but like it was dark and like when you can't see the view, it just wasn't giving. So, yeah, but anyway, let's go to lunch and then let's go to Tiger Park, not Tiger Kingdom, because Tiger Kingdom didn't have the babies. So, yeah. Okay, y'all, we have to eat lunch at a pool, they said, so. This place is so hilly. Do y'all see how steep that is? And that's where I just came from. I think the pool around this corner. Okay. Let's go. The incline is at least on eight. <laughs> like, I'm taking strides up this. This is a mountain, but it's gorgeous. Metro. Yo, Metro. So we're at the pool, but why is the menu in like the middle? Like, I don't really want to get wet. Thank you. Thank you so much. I killed the ball with no evidence. I pay my dues like every scene. They said some fresh as a peppermint. Riches they come ain't no better. Starting to smell a little crazy, but we're going. You can get different packages, or you can get one, but we got smallest, like the babies, and then medium, and that was about fifty dollars. You only get ten minutes with each, so they making money up in here. Alright, go like a treasure chest. Alright, go. Okay. And then you should approach the tiger from behind and touch them firmly. When you go to the inside, you need you need to stay together and follow stuff all the time. Don't walk alone. No flat when you take a photo. You need to uh, wash your hand and take off your shoes. Don't let baby tiger lick your hand and then carry up the baby tiger. Okay. Okay, wash your hand there. Thank you. Okay, thank you. It's like it gets a little tense in there. Yeah. Because I'm um, sometimes a sudden movement. But um it's weird, like they still have like a cat smell. Yeah. You know, so it's like cat like you know, it smells like cat, but like a different kind of cat. I don't know. Is this it? Or small uh, medium. No way this is the entrance. Okay, yeah. I was about to say that gate. <laughs> but they were two and five months? Uh <laughs> no, I think so the other one was seven. This is the oldest. Oh, okay. I thought the oldest was five months. But they could be. Uh, I'm a little taller. Then the last time over here. Okay, follow me. Stay down or come up? I'm up. Okay, that's two years. Two years. And two years. A boy. And two years a boy. Oh, yeah. They're both big. Yeah. Boy big. Yeah. Okay, do you want to buy one? Okay, sir. Okay. 
I feel like your mom's gonna love me. Ah, <laughs> uh -oh. hey. The big ones, oh my God, it's so scary. But I'm going right now to go get some cash to tip that man because he kept me alive. Like I owe you my life, I'm literally about to tip you. Y'all, I'm just so glad I didn't meet him. Like I wanted to do smallest and biggest. I'm like, okay, but the me the biggest was Huge. Well, yeah, we just left our tip for the men who kept us alive. Kiara was cracking me up. She was like, I can feel my grandfather laughing at me. Whoa, I didn't know tigers bark. The fences are electric. Also, that was another thing that scared me. But I don't like to see animals in cages. So, you want to go back up? Or? Uh, yeah, we can go back up. Okay. Our driver actually stayed here. How sweet of him because he knew we needed another driver. <laughs> so I'm about it. He about his business, I'm about my ride. I wasn't even recording that oh. whole time. We're back at the resort. The rundown is, so the driver that we got through the Grab app, he just waited for us while we were at the Tiger Park, nice. which was lit because he was just our driver after that. And you're not at Tiger Park for long. I didn't know this, but you don't need like a reservation. Like it's literally like you just walk up there, you pay for what you want, you go, it's 10 minutes per Tiger, you're out. And 10 minutes may sound like a short amount of time, but when you're in that box with them cats, <laughs> time is moving slow. <laughs> it was fine. And then yeah, so we got some party supplies. Yeah. And then I went to get some goggles. Cause y'all know I'm a mermaid. We're just gonna change. This was the perfect outfit to wear. Yes, yeah, so we're just gonna change and then have a pool day, have some drinks, just relax. Bright and early in the morning, I have the elephants at like 6.45 a.m. So yeah, and then my massage is confirmed for tomorrow. <laughs> and we just talked to them about a laundry service because y'all know we went on the move, like we need to wash clothes. I need to wash, so we'll do that tomorrow as well. <laughs> oh, you're up here. <laughs> No. Where are you? I'm that way. Yeah. Get up some more. This resort is <laughs> very confusing. Now I know where like the main stuff is. I know where, well, there's still a whole nother restaurant. Okay, y'all, this is Kiara's room. Yes. How nice. She has like a top floor. TV, balcony, a wraparound balcony. And this is her view. Okay, so you are you are kind of close to me though. Yeah, yeah. Ooh, I feel lightheaded. <laughs> All these stairs. <laughs> yes. <laughs> and hills. <laughs> but this is nice. Oh, this is tough. It's like yours. Literally. And you have like a nook here. Yeah, I, have, I didn't know the fridge was in here. Oh yeah. She got a tub too. Yeah. Did you see your robes? Yes. Girl, yes. Love a row. Love a row. <laughs> but alright y'all, let's change and get litty. Yes. Okay y'all, they just cleaned my room. I will show you guys. The bathroom still looks... <laughs> I mean, I just got ready in here, so... Yeah, but the main thing I wanted to show y'all was the view from the outside. My little nook. I have this on clothes because I just... Especially because I'm on the ground floor, like, people be walking around, so yeah. But this... is what I love right here. So, yeah, that's basically what I wanted to show you. <laughs> yeah, I'm about to change my hair out and just put on a bathing suit. RIP to the silk press. I really only wanted it for the pictures with the tiger just because I never have my hair down in photos. So I was like, why not just do it? But now, the natural hair is out. And yeah, I'm just gonna throw on a bathing suit. We're gonna get some pool strength. I got my goggles, like, so fun, so fun, so fun. Maybe I'll wear that same dress I was wearing earlier. Okay, this is, my bathing suits. If you're a loyal subscriber, you've definitely seen this before. It's from Zaful, and I just took my makeup off because I'm about to get in the pool, y'all. So here we go. And all we have to do is come on right out here to chill. I'm pretty sure right there is a bar. So we gotta go find out. Have a margarita. Second, every time.
minute, man, I swear that she can get it. Say if you a bad bitch, put your hands up high. Hands up high, hands up high. Tell them turn the lights down right now. Put me in the room. I'm talking about dark room. Go, go. I recognize your fragrance. Hold up, you ain't never gotta say shit. And I know your taste is a little bit mm, high maintenance. Mm, everybody else basic. You live life on an everyday basis with poetry. Yeah. Are we going? Are we going this way? Are we going this way? What's that? We have to do both. You gotta go this way and then this way. Okay. So we're all gonna go. Yeah. 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 Okay. 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 Ok
do I want to eat that food? But everyone on TikTok said the food was good. You eat at the end and they were like, the place actually doesn't smell like as bad as they thought it would. So yeah, but let me get ready. I was also like kind of nervous on my outfit too because there's a, there's a portion when we are like, you know, just walking with the elephants and there's a portion where we're like getting wet with the elephants. So I was like, hmm, what do I want to wear? But I'm just going to wear a bathing suit under my shorts, I think. Um, so yeah, I'll start off with shorts and then I think I'm just going to bring that same dress that I've been rocking. That's like my go-to dress that I'll just wear to, I'll pack that for after because you can like shower after apparently. And um, for when the, we drive back. You can shower there. I'm like, do I want to shower there? It's like an outdoor shower thing and you have to bring your own soap. I don't really feel like packing all that stuff, so I might just dug it out till I get here and it'll be fine. And then after this, I need to get a wax. I don't need to, but I prefer to get one. So that's gonna be a whole experience. And then um, I have a massage. I have a massage schedule for 3.30. And another good thing is like all the excursions are pretty quick, which I like. Like I'm not trying to be somewhere all day. You know, we have a lot to fit in a day. Like the tiger experience that we were probably there 30 minutes max great and then this i'm supposed to be back around 11 30 which is also great they said depending on traffic so leaving at 6 getting back at 11 30 and mind i live so far from everything so i'm glad because i was like oh my god am i gonna miss my massage but anyway y'all i've been yapping for goodness five minutes now so let's get started on the morning Time went wherever, but I decided to do makeup because I'm like, I'm gonna be taking pictures, so let me just be cute, especially because a stranger's taking my photo. Like, yeah, let me just make sure my face, just a little bit of concealer and blush and mascara. But okay, time for my daily probiotic. And then now we're gonna do the charcoal bill. Yeah, I've been doing, I mean, I haven't really had like street food though, but even still, I'm just taking precautions. I'm already prepared for my finger to come out pitch black from this damn charcoal. Here we go. Okay, I'm gonna clean up, pack my bag, head to breakfast. It's 6.10, we gotta go. Time got away from me, but I have an important question. Do we like no hat? Or I have this hat that I've like been wanting to wear and I mean, it looks crazy right now. It'll probably mess up my hair. But I just feel like this could be the safer option. I don't know. Maybe I'll just bring it. Um, but for right now, I like my hair. But if it starts going crazy, then I'll put the hat on. Let me try the hat. Ooh, girl, I don't think I'm gonna be, have time to get breakfast. Let's see. Cause I think I'm a really, yeah, like I like this look. You know, something different. Let's see, do I look crazy? The hat does look a little wonky, but you know, you kind of just have to wear it and it will form to your head. Okay, I know my hair's messed up, but I think I'm gonna do no hat and I'll do the hat for a time when I actually have my hair down. Okay, you guys, I'm all set. Got the bug spray. Let me just spray a little bit. gonna go to breakfast and head on up there i have to be there at 6 45 it's 6 20 so i have like 10 minutes for breakfast y'all know it's a long walk these are my water shoes i'm so excited okay this is my breakfast watermelon and this is lychee juice i just tried it and it's so good like the mornings it's so clear like do y'all see the water right there I don't know if I'm gonna have time to go to the beach while I'm here, but the next place we're at, we'll definitely go to the beach. I had enough time to use the bathroom. 
thank the Lord. Cause I was like, okay, before I go here to the elephants, let me get my last chance at a bathroom. But I just realized I forgot to pack my hand sanitizer, which is annoying, but I think I'll be fine. Like there's usually a bunch of places to wash your hands here. This car is so nice. Oh, um, can I go in the back? Thank you. So nice.
Grandmothers, fathers, mother, and children. And original, original of the Thai elephant and orig original of the Mahu family, they come from the east side of Thailand. Half one province, this province is close to Cambodia. And mm -hmm. this province we call the Big Gate Elephant Village in Thailand because everywhere behind the Mahu homes have a domestic elephant stay with them. So the culture of them is like this they have big family. Some family they have one elephant or two elephants in the family. For example, if Mahut dies before elephant or Mahut is too old, they not take care of the elephant. Next generation needs to be the Mahut, like generation has started next generation. They do like this for a long time already, like the culture of them. So it means Mahut they need to teach the children what kind of food they eat, what kind of grass they eat, when they're sick, when they have something happen. So it means the children need to learn everything. Elephant is them like a value animals in the family. Like a pet, something like that. So it means uh, the Mahut need to teach the children everything. The children also need to respect the elephant. Also. And some elephant, they was born in the family. They grow up the same age with the people. So sometimes they are best friends together. And the language that they use, some word is not Thai language. It's mixed between Cambodians and Thai mixed together. Some word, I don't know also what it means. But Mahut, they know each other with the elephant. I got wet and see my mascara is everywhere. <laughs> but overall, it's 10 out of 10. It's super muddy, but we're about to go get in the showers. I'm gonna wipe my face off. And then. Okay, y'all, I'm back. I just got out the shower. I just put on like some pants. I'm actually about to go get a wax, y'all. I'm so curious about this experience, but my cousin Mari just got here, so she's gonna come with me. So, yeah, I'm so out of focus. But yeah, come with me to get a wax and put it. Marjorie went first, y'all. I was too scared. But I'm next, so let's see. I need to get my laundry done. Um, they do, they charge by the piece here. But like, for example, one piece is anywhere from like 30 to 150 baht, which really is not bad. Like 30 baht is like 80 cents. And 150 baht is like $4. But like that's per piece. So I'm gonna just add it up right now. Hopefully it's not too bad. I just have it. They said they're gonna have someone come pick it up right now. The resort name. So 
So my total came out to, oh, I didn't even write it down. This is my total and bought 16.30, which in dollars, it's $44. Probably with fees about $50, which is very expensive. Like I'm not even on front, but I really have no choice. Like I need to just get the service done. So in the convenience, is worth it but if i had like more time i would just go to like town i would just go to like a street and they have laundry places all over here and they charge by the pound which makes more sense than charging by the damn piece like charging by the piece is crazy um but that's a lot of clothes that need to be washed and they smell bad y'all like i was you know in tokyo we were sweating and like i need more underwear like it's it's worth it but anyway let's go on over to the pool because i only have like it's 145 my massage is at 3:30, so let's hurry up Y'all, I'm trying to figure out how to put this bathing suit on and I just had to look up an old picture of myself to see how I was wearing this even. So we're gonna try, this is the top. This looks like, what? Hold on, I don't know why it's so dark. Um, but yeah, this is the top. I have to hurry up, I'm running late. We have the boat day today. But I'm just like, how in the world? But okay, I gotta figure this out. Okay, the angle is like a struggle this morning. But, guys, I feel so nauseous. And you know, I've been trying to avoid this. Like, I've been good about eating my charcoal pills and my probiotics. But, genuinely, I think those are still helping because that's probably the reason I'm not, like, vomiting right now. But I just feel nauseous. So I did take some Pepto-Bismol. I'm getting ready to get on this boat and I'm like, oh my gosh, like, please, please, please. I'm close to like making myself throw up, but I don't want to do that because these toilets are low flow. Like, I don't know. But we have so much to catch up on. Oh my god, I hate this angle though. I'm just going to do a basic middle part. What was the last thing we even talked about? We were lit out here, so I didn't really get to vlog that much of like dinner and stuff. But same old, same old, you know, got pad thai. And yeah, it was great. Now where's my brush on here? The wax. Okay, let me tell you all about the waxing experience. It honestly was not as bad as I thought. She did a really thorough job, like really thorough. It was just, it was different. Like we were literally in her house basically. I guess like she also lived there. I don't know if it was the most sanitary thing, which is why I'm glad. Like I went right after my cousin and I'm pretty sure that lady did not wash her hands. Like I'm pretty sure she did not. And you know, I'm okay because I'm like, okay, that's my cousin. And I was like telling her, I was like, girl, when do you think the last customer was? Because what if she has not? And she was like, we were just like, okay, we're just not gonna think about that. But yeah, so that was one thing. We got the wax done. Then I came back here and I got a massage. Now I've never gotten a Thai massage before. I think the treatment that I got was called Chiba because that's like, they said that was the famous treatment. So I wanted the famous treatment. So I got the Chiba massage. Y'all, this lady was like standing on my neck. I'm pretty sure she was walking on me. I was expecting a rub down, okay? I was expecting like to get oiled up and rubbed on. No, I feel like I just got beat up. Like, I do not think I want one of those massages again. It was painful, like it was painful. But like, it was like, I wasn't saying ouch or anything because I just wanted to, you know, I was like, okay, maybe this is only one part of it. And, like the massage was 90 minutes. I'm thinking, okay, maybe this is just the first 30 minutes. I ended up falling asleep and I would get woken up by my own snoring because you know, I'm snoring. I don't usually snore, but that thing presses against your sinuses so it would like clog me up. But anyway, I got woken up by my own snoring and then all of a sudden I just randomly started crying 
And I'm like, what? But apparently, I researched this later, but like, so massages can cause you to cry. Like, it can cause like an emotional release and it can like relieve tension from trauma. So I think that's what happened to me. And I'm like, oh my gosh. But especially, and it happened like when she cracked my hip. People say your hip is where you store all that trauma. Trauma, trauma, what the hell? But, so yeah, that was an experience. So yeah, after the massage, we came back, I came back here and, no, I came back here, I literally laid by the pool, took a nap for an hour. Then, I woke up, cause I was like, oh my God, I'm outside. <laughs> I came inside, took another nap, and we were just like prolonging going to dinner. I was just so glad that Kiara and Marge were also on the same type of time, like everyone was slumped, cause it was slumped, we were lit. Then we finally go to dinner. I get my usual, actually no, I changed it up. I got shrimp and chicken pad thai. So amazing. So I ordered another one, y'all. I think this could also be why I'm nauseous because maybe I just over ate. But I don't know. I'm actually starting to feel better though. I was really weird on taking the Pepto-Bismol because I thought that would make me throw up. Um, Cause you know, the taste, but I actually feel so much better now. And it also could be anxiety because this is pretty anxious. I'm pretty anxious these days, but yeah, y'all. Um, that's just what's been going on with me. What's been going on with me. Today we're, oh, an elephant. I mean, amazing experience. Literally, I can't even put it into words, but if you're coming to Thailand, definitely do that. I decided, no, I researched and went to like a really ethical elephant place. So there's no riding, no chains, no nothing like that. And I loved it. And you could tell that the elephants were happy because when the people came around, like the elephants perked up and like they were, you know, they were like happy. Like I feel like other places, like not gonna lie y'all, that tiger place we went to, that was crazy. Like, I don't know, I don't know how ethical that is, but um, I just had no idea. But now I like looked into it for the elephants and when you know when animals are happy to see you like that's a good sign like they shouldn't be like fearful or like timid around you or like looking behind the back like these elephants were happy there so i was really happy to do that i just have so much content like i have all these tiktoks that i wanted to make but it's like we're about to go to the next location like this is literally our last day in okay our last full day we're doing the pp island tour um i hope it's good it's only 50 dollars, so i'm a little wary but I think it'll be fine. Lunch is included. So, yeah, this is my bathing suit. This is my dress situation. Y'all, I don't know how I packed for this trip, but I don't think I did a good job. Like, I don't think I did a good job. Either that or I'm just going through clothes. Like, because I don't know, I'm like, how did I, my luggage, I brought so much luggage and I always feel like I have nothing to wear out here. So, I don't know. Um, but yeah, this is the hair look. So this is the picture of this. The dress is not gonna be in the photo. This is just the dress I'm wearing today. The photo is gonna be straight bikini, okay? Straight bikini, what time is it, 6.10. Okay, so yeah, I asked the group chat, I was like, did anyone else feel nauseous? And Kiara just said she felt nauseous before dinner. She did, at dinner she did order a green tea, and I was like, why is she ordering green tea? She was nauseous, so I'm gonna, maybe I'll get that at breakfast, I'm gonna get some tea. But honestly, I feel better after the Pepto-Bismo and I drink some Sprite, which they're probably gonna charge me, but it'll probably only be like 35. Um, so, yeah. But for this boat day, like, I think I'm gonna pack, I might bring my gel with me on the boat. Cause like, I have to get the fire pictures, like I have to, this is like the gorge, this is like, you know, what Thailand is, well, I mean, they're known for a lot, but like, you know, these are like the pretty islands I used to hear before on like those cute boats. Like this is what you, this is where I'm going today. So I have to get the content. The pictures are going crazy. But yeah, I'm braiding my hair now. I'm eventually gonna take this braid out, y'all already know. And then I am gonna do light makeup. Oh, that reminds me. I wanted to ask them if anyone has waterproof mascara. Child, yesterday I, you know, I put my makeup on trying to be cute for my elephant photos. We got in the shower with the elephant. I looked crazy because my mascara was running all down my face. Those photos would probably look crazy. I don't have the photos yet. Oh, by the way, I told you all I was worried about getting pictures there. They had a whole photography team that did an amazing job. So shout out to them. And the pictures are free included with the price. So 
they take like a couple days to upload but of course by the time this is up you will have already seen them but for anyone else who's like going to be solo traveling or just going to the elephants alone like i did oh i packed mine you'll be fine with the content um i need to get dressed and ready and i like to listen to music so i'm gonna do that but I'll talk to you all when I go to breakfast. It's 6, 12 right now. Our ride picks up at 7, 15, and I wanna eat beforehand. So, I mean, I'm not too behind, but I gotta get it move on. Okay, I ended up changing. Um, Cause remember I was like, I just felt like I had no shirts, but then I realized I bought button ups in Tokyo because I just love their necklines. Um, but I'm just gonna wear this <laughs> to the boat with these shorts and then I pack the dress for later. You guys, the nausea is back, but it's not as bad um and it's also pouring down rain it was pouring out i woke up to the pouring down rain but it's still raining out there as you can see i don't even want to go outside in this but i gotta go to breakfast oof 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 um i did pack an umbrella they do have umbrellas for us here at the resort but i don't want to bring the resort umbrella because this is too big this is too big to carry around. So, I don't think I'm gonna bring, I'm just gonna bring my pocket sized one. I still need to take, I'm just like, do I even feel like taking the charcoal and the probiotics? Because I'm nauseous and I'm like, ugh. But I'm gonna just take them and then we'll go to breakfast. I ended up, I'm pack, I packed like my hair stuff. I packed a hat, my change of clothes, sunblock, bug spray, all that good stuff. You know, I might take that Pepto with me on there too. I feel like that's a smart idea. But um, yeah, let me do my last minute stuff then I'll finally be out the door, but I just have to tell you all I changed. I like this way better. And this is one, like it's cold out there, oh my God. Okay, we're at breakfast. It's here, time for the boat day. Y'all tell me why Marge only brought this small bag. I'm like, where's your change of clothes? Where's your this, where's your towel gonna go? So they're gonna go back to the room and get more stuff. I have this huge bag right here. So, yeah. I got some green tea to hopefully help my stomach. But I had to get, I had to run the omelet bag. And then apple juice. Okay, you guys, we're done with the safety. Let me make sure I'm recording. Okay, yeah, we're done with the safety presentation. I bought flippers. It was an extra 150 baht, and then we also got the long tail boat. That was 1800 baht. <laughs> and I have these. <laughs> and I get my feet too much. They're ashy. I did bring water shoes, but I don't know. Flippers, when you're snorkeling, it just makes it more fun to me. It's just easier to swim. Oh my gosh, you can already start to see the water get clear. We're going to like so many islands, so I'm excited. And we haven't been to the beach since we've been here, so it's yeah. overdue. But we're getting on the speedboat. I took the motion sickness pill. I've already been nauseous since this morning. So we're gonna pray for this boat. Jump off that boat too. So, yeah. I'm gonna take off my shirt now. Yeah. 
Yeah, we just took some bomb photos and now we're gonna get in the water. Okay. 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 Y'all need to fly as a pelican. I treat my ball like they want to want. I treat these hoes like they want to want. I smoke the dog when you go and walk. I smell like door and I overcome. I made a plan like a ton of dogs and I had double go with some bubble gum. I got a chain and some other sun and I drive all and over my door and water. Shout out eating crazy and we way in London. Back a hat and you all like a... Here's the buffet. I just want to eat and then I'll be down to walk around. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. The boat on time, they were not leaving us. No, ma'am. Get into the views. The president, and it ain't been no back and forth ever since. Okay, while no one's on a boat yet, y'all, why did like five people throw up in front of us? <laughs> it was in succession. Uh, <laughs> like, yes. It was like one first, huh? then people saw her throwing up, so then they started throwing up. Uh -huh. Vomit after vomit, like throw up in bags. And the first bag she threw up in, it was clear. We could all see her. It was right there. And it was like, oh my god. I don't think they, that they understood English, though, so they don't. I don't think they took the most sickness pill. But I've been feeling okay. Like, I, I, occasionally I'll get thrown around, but like, I never felt like I was really about to throw up or anything. Oh, the elephant! Oh, no. My mom has like 50 of these Same. in her house. Yeah. She told me Olivia to look for elephants. Yeah, aunt wanted me to get her elephant. I'll have to look. Yeah, that was actually the scariest boat ride of my life. And it started raining. Like, it was just so much going on. So I'm just sitting here processing that I survived that. We're on the last island. Um, I can't remember what this one's called. But we just ordered drinks. They'll bring your drinks to you. You just have to pay. We had to pay for these chairs. But it was only 150 baht. But I only have 450 baht left in cash. So, would they take hard? Thank God. 
we are just chilling here. We were gonna get on the banana boat and jet ski. The thing is, it's like a cloudy day and the waves are crazy, so I'm scared to get on the jet ski. Banana boat, we're gonna fall off. <laughs> but yeah, I'm down to just chill by the beach. We haven't had a beach day really, so. We got this whole excursion for $52. <laughs> like the boat may be a little sketchy. Oh, look at them more, but you can't beat it. Look at what? So the boat may be a little, oh, them, they were closing in the water. Oh. Started out smiling, they paying me double. Yeah, you can drip chip, baby, like mustard. Yeah.